day three though as she scoffs her face mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway leaving camp today to have a bit of explore around the property so we have been here before as i've said but um we didn't really do too much drive around did we no so yeah. Out the so anyway, today we'll go for a bit of a drive around down the river to the farthest reaches of the property and uh, see what we can find and explore this river a bit more because it's absolutely beautiful. Went for a bit of a walk yesterday, didn't take any cameras, just from our campsite and um, it's absolutely stunning. So anyway, we'll get on down the road and uh, see what we find today done. River's up a bit. Must add some uh, rain downstream or upstream. Or they've let water out just like last time. Anyway, I'll just check the shabby pot while we're here. You confident, mate? Oh, not really. Oh, I don't know if I can pull it up, mate. Is it got that many in it? Oh, it feels heavy. Oh, it's got weed all over it, mate. Oh, no. Oh, oh no! I'll pull it over to the shore, I reckon. Yeah, it'll be the go. Far out. So just followed a little track off the side of the uh, main track. Seems like a nice big hole down here in the river. So just got our walking shoes on and go have a look, eh? Nice and wide river here. How much did those boys say it was up by? The river? 1.3. 1.3. So she's flooding a little bit at the moment. Random up, mate, random up. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful countryside around here. Just driving up over these hills. Oh, darn, there's a gate. It's one of the lads who are working on the, um, working on a dam up the road here. They've been drilling. We stopped and had a chat to them and they said that uh, the river's risen enough that they can't get through the crossing up here. So our trip will be pulled short a little bit. But we'll head to the um, head to that old homestead where we stayed last time, Dar. Yep, sounds like it. And we'll have a look around there and show Glenn and Karen around there and have a look at the way the land is. But um, yeah, from the sound of it, you can't go too much further than that because the river's up too much. But anyway, don't know how close we are to it. But it's just an absolutely stunning drive through here. Here we are again at the old homestead. Just watch out for your little brown mates. A microwave dish. There's the microwave. <laughs> Well, this is where we camped last time. The very first time we bought our trailer, I thought it'd be a good idea to put it up on that thing there. And uh, today, that wouldn't be very good. Well, it's not very good any time, actually, as we learnt. Glenn and Karen think we're off our heads, don't you? <laughs> but yeah, beautiful. Just great memory stuff. <laughs> We took that box. Right, eh? Bit of a lunch spot, though. Have a look at this for lunch. What do you reckon, Glenn? Yeah, look at the view. Good, eh? Did you say it? Yeah, I'll beep it out. 
Michelle's just trying to contend for the win. I don't think paper tears are going to work done. Oh, yeah, they will. What are we making? Sandwich plates. Oh, yeah, we're going to have steak, lettuce, cheese. We both have steak, lettuce, cheese, aren't we? Okay, I'm not sure it is. Oh, there's a fair bit. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want one or two? Just one, thanks. Just couldn't control this wind though, unfortunately. But the view up here is pretty good. Right, a beautiful lunch spot. Heading back to camp now. We've got a mad cook up again tonight. And uh, we're just going to stop and cut, get some wood first. But um, yeah, what a beautiful drive it is out here on this station. Beautiful rolling hills. Yeah, that's absolutely mint spot out here. You could dead set just spend a week. But uh, I've only got four days, which is almost a week though. Time for week. Time for week, yeah. <laughs> anyway, one wood. Five minute stop. Wood, wood mission complete. To camp. Right, I mean Michelle's turn to do dinner tonight. Karen and Glenn cooked this beautiful Masterman last night. Oh, how good was it? It's going to be pretty hard to live up to. No pressure. I don't feel the pressure now. <laughs> Not outside the bedroom. Oh. <laughs> Anyway, goodness me. So I've just got some, uh, Michelle's gone to Carl's and got some big lumps of lamb. Lamb in the camp oven's pretty special, as most people have got camp ovens already know. I've done this a few times, so it's probably not much point going through the whole thing, but two bits of lamb, a bunch of herbs and spices, garlic, gonna How many it. kilos of lamb? Three? I don't know, three is it done? Yeah, three I don't know, you bought it. Yep. At it. Beef stock, boat it up, throw a bunch of this stuff in it. Put it on the fire for about three hours. What's this stuff? Salt, pepper. Oh, you know, salt, pepper, mixed herbs, herbs rub, rub garlic, garlic, Worcestershire. Worcestershire. Okay. The whole work stuff. Bit so, of mud falling off the trailer. Yeah, it's been happening all, all week. Anyway, I have washed my hands. I really have this time. I know, I checked. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're feeding other people. That's the only reason. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's right. That's what I was trying to tell Michelle, but she said no. Let's go throw a pair of dirty jocks in. <laughs> oh, oh, <God. laughs> oh. But anyway, that that blunt, oh, that blunt, that knife's proper blunt now, by the way. As I, I said before, for a hunting knife, makes a good butter knife. Look at this stuff. Look at this stuff. Should I do it like that again? Salt. No one has a salt problem, the lot just went in. <laughs> no one's got any heart conditions. <laughs> you will. Oh, oh you will. Oh. It doesn't kill you, makes you stronger, right? You got all week to work it off. Wish to shit. This is some, what I might do, a little trick. 
got some child off in it though. Get it off! <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Leah or Lee and Perrins or Leah and Perrins? Lee and Perrins. Lee and Perrins. Worcestershire sauce. And, see what um, it's like. Apparently I say that wrong, but uh, see what it's like. But I do have one found that bottle top on the way to the Diamantina on the side of the road. Dating back to uh, the 1840s. We got that at home in our little treasure trove. Anyway, just looking good. Good olive oil. Bait it. Did you get the um, plant based one this time, Duff? No, I got real beef stock. Oh. It says real. What's Sorry, Jono. Can you get unreal stuff? You can, you get, can um, get unreal stuff. You can get plant based, what was it? Plant based Chipotle sauce. And on the back of it says, great on. Um, Great with beef. <laughs> but I thought the whole point of plant based and that was because it's, it's like vegan. vegans and stuff. We might just uh, top that up a little bit for water and then we'll just wait for Carl's and she's all good to go, Dar. Can't wait. Rum time. I've already got one. Ching Cheers. Ching. Righto. Mr. Meatco is going to kill me. But when we have Tony Renee. A hawk came down and was eating this biltong out of my hands just about dull, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. And today, I'm hoping... The fish do the same. What? Try it's good biltong. But yep. I'm going to get on a fish with a bit of Mr. Mr. Meat Co's biltong. Righto. Oh. Should have bought some more biltong down so I can re rig it. We'll learn. We'll get there. Glenn's on! Fucking Glenn's on! <laughs> Glenn's on in my spot. Yeah, well, good luck getting that out, mate. Maybe we'll, we'll get him in. Oh, I see. I mean, you hit through in his lip. Yeah. Catfish. First fish of the trip, Glenn. Yeah. It's one of them river cats. Yeah. Off you go, buddy. Glenn's on again. Straight away, mate. Got a catfish. What do you got? A sooty. A little sooty. A little sooty. Hold it away mate, it looks bigger. Yeah, that's it. That's what we were after though, mate. Bloody hell, fish number two. Oh yeah! Oh, yep! What do you got? Yep. Sooty! Fish on! Yeah! Oh, yeah just caught, just caught the one you released. <laughs> there yeah. we go. Timmy Rumble's first ever fish in freshwater. A little sooty tone. I thought I foul hooked him, but I didn't. It was just wrapped around his fin. Anyway, there we go. I broke the, uh, broke the duck. Broke the duck, mate. Glenn's on again. Tell you what, we're having a field day since we switched it up. Another little oh, sooty. He's little. Oh, he's little. Little sooty. Glenn's on three, I'm on one. Right out, Glenn. Scores uh, three one, is it? 3-1, you're on my bait now. So yeah. if a new catch is my score. <laughs> oh, that's nice. I'm gonna go over here. Get out of that tree, your dog. Oh, nice shot. Man. Thanks, mate. Glenn's on again. Catfish. This is bullshit, mate. This will be four. That's pretty heavy. Yeah, probably catfish, eh? Catfish. Oh! Nearly had a double line hookup, mate. What is, is she it? a caddy? No, that's not a sooty. sooty. Just was got stuck in the leaves, mate. In the leaves? That's the best one I've caught today. Yep, that's about the same size one I got. Sooty? <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. Oh. Glenn's on again.
Now the sorry, yep. You know, I it's, see what one looks like. it's bullshit anyway, mate. You just keep catching the same one. <laughs> <laughs> just, oi, forget about the tally, mate. Just catch a fish. <laughs> That's 5 1. Oh, oh. All day sooties. Apparently. Five one, five one, it's five, five one, one, but I've made myself a cup holder, Glenn. <laughs> how, brilliant, how convenient. That's brilliant. <laughs> right, Glenn's on again. This oh, is get done it. Oh, no. no. False. Oh, broken dreams, mate. <laughs> Unlucky. <laughs> <laughs> Just after broken dreams. Yep, Glenn's gone and caught himself the same fish again. Like, this is competition, mate. You wouldn't win nothing. I've put my rod down because Glenn's on again. <laughs> this is fish number six and a half. Yeah, Glenn, Glenn's gone seven. Even though he didn't land it, that's a penalty of two fish. So you're really on four. That's something else, isn't it? Well, that's a good size sooty. It's a big sooty. Oh, it's not that big, but it's bigger. It's the biggest one so far. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it's not that big. <laughs> Oh, it's because it's been eating all Glenn's baits in the same hole. <laughs> That's a better fish. Bloody hell. Mate, give it a kiss. Mwah. All right, get back here, sea dog. It's not even a sea, a river dog. <laughs> river dog. <laughs> river dog. I'll go down for big ones, bro. Look at this. Oh, that's oh, catch of the day. It's a stud. <laughs> oh, it's a stud. <laughs> and he's a lovely fish. He's a lovely fish. That's the biggest one of the day. Glenn thinks nine's good. I think one big one's better than nine little ones. <laughs> And probably six of them are the same. But anyway, big sooty. <laughs> blub, blub, blub. Oh. I thought you said it was a barra, Glenn. Oh, Rob. That was a big hit for a reasonable sized fish. He must have swum past and just went. Yeah. Hey. That's, a, that's a decent sized one, Glenn. Yeah, no, not really. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I think it's a barra, Tim. Oh. I think it's a barra, bud. <laughs> oh. That's not too bad. Yeah, it's a bit bigger than Glenn's ones. <laughs> <laughs> Glenn oh. retired so you could catch some. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what we're saying, is it? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, lamb's done. Oh, look at that. It's pretty much pulled, Len. Sorry about that. Oh, oh look. <laughs> you can't even cut it. It's probably in there half an hour too long. Go ahead and get some of that, mate. Any good? Deluxe. Deluxe? Mm. So let's good. hook in then, I reckon. It's deluxe. Yep, yep right, let's, let's do it. That's next level. Righto. Well, dinner was a success. And, uh... Kaz has mixed up a uh, Mars bar, isn't it, Kaz? Yes. Mars bar damper for dessert. So we'll give our thoughts and criticisms after we eat it, eh? <laughs> well done, babe. High five for dinner. Yeah, pretty much. High five, man. High five, man. Awesome. So anyway, we're going to tuck into that damper. Enjoy this fire. We've got a few more big logs to throw on it. We'll turn that prison light off. A few more rumbies. A few more rumbies. And uh, enjoy our last evening out here at Beckford Station. What a great time it's been. Beautiful. All right. Well, thanks, Glenn, for coming on Timmy Rumbles Tours. And Kaz? Pleasure. Thank you very much, mate. I'm impressed to the very end. Yeah. It's a pretty good time, eh? Beautiful. What do you reckon, Kaz? Good? Awesome. All right. Busy getting one word. Yeah, she's too busy sorting out dessert. Oh my god, have a look. Your oh, street. Have a go at it. Yum. Oh, that's beautiful. Lovely. Oh, well, like I said, uh, invoice will be in the mail and uh, seven day terms. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, leave a, uh, leave a review on Google and um, we'll be all good. <laughs> Online, just under a thousand bucks. Special. I'm going to turn this off. You just dribble. You just dribble rubbish. Oh, it's pretty cold. But I tell you what, it's pretty nice on June. <laughs> <laughs>